For sure. Well then. All right, we are now going to underground walkway because it's Sunday, so we gotta drink our uh, special juice. I should write something. It's also the first day of the week, so daily, weekly. It's the Sunday, I should say. There we go. Juice. Welcome. And this should increase our knowledge. Nice. Is it? Yep, beautiful. Alright. And we're going to see a movie with Ryuji. Let's go. What? <laughs> okay, everyone. In the comments. Cake or pie. We'll find out who the real psychopaths are. Flying hell. I love it. Oh, stop. Actually. Alright, and we gotta say they do. Right? <laughs> I'll pay you back for that. Cake or pie. I love it. It's so good. <clears throat> Alright. Now, it seems like we're going to have an event today. Hey, hey. We're cleaning up. Oh, yeah, that's right. We have the uh, the cleaning up event. Forgot about this. Sorry, but I'm in a bit of a hurry. You go to Shujin, right? I heard things have been rough there lately. What with that violent incident? You want to go talk about it somewhere? Thank you for your concern. However, I really am in a hurry, so if you'd excuse me... Come on, there's no need to be shy. Like I said... If you're busy, I'll put my number in your phone so you can call me later. Sound like a plan? Stop it. What do you want? Don't get worked up. I'm just being friendly here. Uh, what the? What are you getting so jumpy about? Like you're anything special. for the trouble. Yes, I'm fine now. It was pretty scary though. Uh, uh um May I ask you something? So, what made you step in to help me? I see. Well, I apologize for asking something so strange. You're headed to the cleanup as well, right? The cleanup? <gasps> Look at the time! I'm so sorry, I haven't even thanked you properly yet! Oh no, I forgot my gym clothes at school! I'll see you at the cleanup soon. We can talk more then if you'd like. Pardon me. Took you so long. Did you really come here from home in your gym clothes? 
must be so nice to be a guy. Huh? Ain't it normal? And, uh, are you planning on doing this cleanup in that outfit? Of course not! I brought my gym clothes with me. I was gonna change in the bathroom, but now there's a huge line. Oh, that makes sense. Sounds like it sucks to be a girl. It's such a nice day out that even the weather seems to be mocking us. Dude, could you try pushing your way into our conversation a little less awkwardly next time? I bet some Kichi Joji clean freak hung paper dolls all over and prayed for clear skies today. Hey. Morning, everyone. Oh? Are you here for the cleanup too, Doc? You got it. Uh, in those clothes? Oh, no. I'm in a difference. There you are, Dr. Maruki. We're going to start prepping soon. Prepping what? I'm part of the cooking crew. Hope you're looking forward to a solid meal. See you all later. Hmm. I can't remember if I brought any like starchy Taro vegetables. <laughs> More like Dr. Popular. I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will be even bigger someday. Good morning, Shujin Academy students and staff. Please pick up all trash located in the areas assigned to your group. Once the cleanup is completed, a lunch of miso soup with pork and vegetables will be served. Ooh, pork miso soup! So that's what Dr. Maruki's fan club is making. FYI, the school already assigned the groups at random. They're four people apiece, boys and girls mixed. Oh, really? Now that those announcements have been made, please break into your groups and head to your assigned areas. All right, let's just get this over with as fast as possible so we can chow down on that soup and get out of here. Hey, that guy? Yeah, him. Is he that transfer student? Yeah. You mean the one in all the crazy rumors? Keep it down. What if he hears us? Ugh. Anyone who just dumps a broken umbrella on the ground like this is human garbage. Oh, before you trash it, you have to make sure you separate the plastic parts from the metal frame. Separate it? How? Like this. Whoa, awesome! I had no idea you knew about that kind of stuff, Takamaki-san. I bet you'd make a wonderful wife. Oh, nah. Sweet, a wallet! Anything in it? Whoa, yeah, shit ton! We go in splitsies on this? Wait, shouldn't we take that to a police box? What? How was that weird? Man, this park is trash. No way this was all done by kids. It's gotta be the work of some no-good adults, too. If you don't mind, may I have the cap on that bottle? Huh? Sure. Oh, are you a collector? Uh, not exactly. Recycling companies collect these and convert them into vials for vaccines. Huh, I didn't know that. Well, that sounds like an awesome way to bring more justice to the world. I'm sorry, but I'm not sure I follow you. Before I add taro to the pot, I have to rub them with salt to reduce the sliminess. Oh, you're an amazing chef. I do cook pretty often at home. Let me try this little technique here. Uh-huh. What the... Why is the wind salty? Uh, sorry. complete. Thank you for your hard work, everyone. Would the leader of each group please come and get the soup for their teams? So, after the soup's doled out, everyone's free to do whatever they want. Huh. Including getting the hell out of here. Oh, okay. Thank you for everything. I don't know the best way to put it, but that sure was a crappy time out there. Oh! 
finally found you. I was trying to find you so I could thank you properly for this morning. So, where'd the other people in your group go? Ah, I see. I'm in pretty much the same situation. If it's all right with you, why don't we eat our soup together? Great! Thanks for the food. I want to thank you again for this morning. That man was even more frightening than he might have appeared to you. So I truly appreciate what you did for me. Thank you so much. Sorry, but I'm not even finished. There's one more issue I need to address. I'm also so sorry for what happened the other day. The run-in we had outside of the guidance office. Remember the discussion we just had? There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Oh, 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 the delinquent transfer student? Mr. Kamoshida had just told me about you a moment prior, so I sort of spoke without thinking there. I heard some of my classmates gossiping about you too. Nothing of the sort. I don't like gossip or rumors and the like. And I know this will sound strange since I just met you, but... You don't seem like the kind of person they describe. It'd be a different story if all those rumors were actually true, though. What were all the crimes I'd heard? Burglary, murder, and elephant tusk trafficking, was it? <laughs> Even I can tell you're joking. What? It just hit me. I haven't introduced myself yet. Oh, I'm sorry to make you go first. I apologize this was such a long time coming, but I hope we can get along well. I believe you already learned from our meeting at school that my... What the hell just happened? Huh, look. Just in time. Here you are. Don't let go of things you like, okay? Sorry, I didn't mean to run out on you like that. Huh? <laughs> I guess you sleuthed me out before I got to tell you. Well, you've cracked the case. I'm Kasumi Oshizawa, a first year. You mean that back there? Oh, it was just some basic gymnastics. It's not that difficult once you get the hang of it. Just a hop, skip, and a jump. Gymnastics, huh? Hey, don't you think some of those moves would be awfully useful? I was just thinking about how the Phantom Thieves need to get some sweeter moves, too. What's the matter, Senpai? Wait, is there a cat somewhere around here? Does that mean you're interested in gymnastics? That makes me so happy. I'd be honored if you'd allow me. The only problem is, I have a favor to ask for myself as well, if you wouldn't mind. Lately, I haven't been getting the results I want from my performances, and I'm worried that I'm overthinking things. So it would be wonderful if you could give me some advice whenever you have the time. Of course I am. I'm not looking for technical coaching, so much as just lending me an ear from time to time. I see. This sounds like a pretty sweet deal to me. What do you think? Thank you. Then we've cut a deal. <laughs> Thank you. 
I've read in the reports that the Phantom Thieves' physical abilities are more acrobatic than the average person's. It seems you've gained an aptitude for specialty equipment as well. Wouldn't a natural conclusion to draw be that you were trained by an expert in that field? Well, tell me the truth. It's with... Alright, so this is a new arcana in uh, Royal. I've seen a little bit of it, but I don't know the full grasp of it. You get a lot of interesting abilities from it, though, from what I can gather. And from what I can see here, at some point, we're going to have to uh, advance the plot to get a certain, past a certain point, and learn new abilities. I'm not really sure when or what the reason is, because I haven't seen that far ahead. So, should be interesting. All right. Oh, why don't we exchange contact information? Huh? It shut down. Sorry, my smartphone's been acting up lately. <laughs> it's back. Okay, I'll contact you when I've got free time, if that's fine. Attention, Shujin Academy students. The cleanup event will be ending momentarily. Please do not discard your trash in the bins here. Instead, bring your waste to the predetermined location for disposal. After that, we will be officially releasing everyone for the day. Thank you all for your hard work. Well, the cleanup seems to be finished. We're already in our gym clothes. Would you care for some basic training before heading home? Let's start with some core exercises. Those are the foundation for staying in shape. Not wrong, if you want to get into gymnastics, you have to have a nice core. That's where it all is. Mm. Alright, let us save. And now, we're going to call Call Common Sense. We need a Guts of level 3 to do it, which is why we didn't do it right away. We also need 5,000 yen, so, yeah. Basically, uh, we're going to be charged... 5,000 yen every time we call her until we master the social link, as far as I know. So, good to know. Hi. Yep. Of course. We're rich, so it doesn't really matter. I see. Very well. Help her right away, then. Here we go. So, this is your room, huh? Hmm. How do I put this? Uh, never mind. So, what kind of kid are you? The way you opposed Mr. Kamoshida, I'd say that you're earnest and have a strong sense of justice. That being said, you called a maid service and requested me? I see. Oh, that's right. You have a criminal record. Okay, then how about this? I'll let you skip class a few times. It's tough not having any place where you belong, isn't it? However, I reserve the right to change my mind if your grades drop. And in exchange, you won't tell anyone that I'm moonlighting as a maid. Sound good? Then it's a deal. think you pulled off so many crimes while attending school. I can't believe you managed that by yourself. There had to be someone at the school helping you. What do you have to say to that? So essentially, um... Randomly during the day, well not randomly, um, throughout the year, every so often Kawakami will basically give us like a free period type of a deal. 
where we can slack off and we can do various things like we can uh, craft thieves tools or we can study read a book so it's a good way to get extra points as well as possibly making new gear so it's a good thing to have all right uh, what am I doing here with one of my students well I guess I should get going Oh, please request me if you need any help with your housework, okay? Well, I mean, we know each other's secret, and it would really put my mind at ease. Besides, I'm, uh, I'm considered over the hill for this type of job, so I don't get requested that often. I'll show my appreciation by making it easy for you to ditch class. That over the hill thing, by the way, refers to the belief in Japan that you're not really you're you're getting ripe. I guess can we put not ripe. You're getting um uh what's the phrase? Past the age of being viable for marriage when you hit your thirties and forties. So yeah, it's kind of a messed up thing. Really, kind of is. Uh, it's still kind of a thing here in the states too, but not nearly as bad as it is in Japan. Like, there are people who go, who can hit, who hit it off really well romantically, but once you find out that they're like, you know, almost 40, they will break it off with you because of that. Which is really messed up in my opinion. Just think about it, okay? Master! I'm just picturing, uh, uh, so you just sitting at the the, the counter like, my man. Yeah, I got it. Thank you so much. You can also um uh call Kawakami to do certain jobs for you too. I think that might be later on. Like I believe you can have her do um the laundry, which is how you clean those dirty clothings. Um, have her make coffee. Stuff like that. Let's get to this. Light up. So yeah, Kawakami is uh, pretty good to have. Oh yes. Uh, do we a sailor? All right. When people were sailing the high, when people think of the high sea, uh, sailing the high seas, they didn't think of pirates. Even though the ruffians who plunder other ships and coastal settlements through force, sometimes, depending on which pirate you're referring to, for some reason they end up getting romanticized. Now then, I'm a Miyakun. He's... What is the answer? Do you know which peg-legged parrot-toting historical figure's appearance became visual shorthand for pirates? <laughs> On body, nice. No, it's uh John Silver. Long John Silver. This is it. Very good. No yep. Way. Nice going. Alright, that gives our knowledge a little bit. Always nice. Let's get to that. Today, we're doing something a little bit different. We're actually going to head to Mementos. We're going to finish off the two uh, missions we have and gather a certain persona. Things first. Let's do the obligatory do save again. So I guess I didn't take as uh, I didn't get through as quick as possible as I possible uh, as I thought I would. Uh, that's mostly because I wasn't prepared for that uh, cleaning up event. I thought we would have had a uh, that wasn't there. So. Hmm. All right. New weapons. All right. Which one? Nope. Uh, come again. All right, so Optimum Mentos. All right, so view requests. We have to do this before heading in. Well then. Oh. They sort of confirm why we're going in. Huh? Listen up. I'm gonna make him pay. Listen up. Yeah. Alright, so we're going for these guys now. 
and explore mementos. Let's go. Okay, let's go. So since this stuff is not really important to the overall plot of things, I'm gonna go ahead and skip it. Uh, do all this stuff off screen. But there are a few things I'm gonna mention real quickly. Bad weather will affect enemies as well as certain things. Hey. Like I think with the pollen warning, let's go. It um uh, makes enemies uh, sleep drowsy. So, back to what I was going to, back to what I was about to say. Um, since these things are optional, well not really optional, you can't have to do them. But since they don't have a major impact, I'm going to do all the requests off screen, unless they are very important or unique stuff. Um, I'm gonna end the set here, but I'm gonna say first and foremost, while you're while you're going through here, if you find Jose, go talk to him. Uh, he will turn. Um, where is it? I didn't even do. He'll turn these into actual accessories, which we can use for special effects. And you can use him to bust a uh, buff up uh, money gain as well as EXP gain. I recommend buffing up money first, then EXP. So. Um, also, you will need the persona. You'll need a persona of the Emperor, Justice, Temperance, and Counselor Arcana when we're done here. I'll make sure to remind you guys when we get back. But till then, hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye bye.